is a very championship style type of year. So usually in those type of races, the, the times are a little bit slower. They're more competitive though. Okay, thank so, you. Yeah, you're very welcome. How is it you want to Yeah. Like you know, Hogan's been an incredible company. They've done so much within the sport, you know, in, sh in a short period of time. So I can't wait until they, they continue in the sport even more. They're, you know, they've uh, just, they've done done a lot of events this year. They support a lot of athletes, a lot of events, and uh, you know, it's just a company that's uh, you know really truly believes in what they're doing. Um, so you've been training in Austin, in your hometown. Yeah. Do you have a training group there? You know, not, not currently. I've, uh, you know, I've been very fortunate that I've been able to join the University of Texas guys on occasion, and uh, you know, those guys bring a new, uh, bring that young vibe back in, and uh, I hope to continue training with them. So, um, what, what are your goals? Like, what's your training plan going into Rio? Well, you know, uh, so after Texas realized that, yeah, uh, I came, you know, I came down with a. Uh, so I've been dealing with a lot of health issues, but you know, so I feel like I, like my, my body and my mind are just starting to come around. Today, I was able to finally push that third and fourth lap. You know, I, I think we still have a long ways to go, uh, but I think it can be it can be done. How important is is getting your kick perfectly down? You know, it's it's a, it's a especially in a championship style type race. Um, you know, today, I, you know, it wasn't the fastest time, but if you go back and look, you look at the video, uh, you can definitely tell that, that I'm, I'm, I'm you know slowly coming back. I think in the last like 200 meters, I might have passed three or four guys. So, you know, it's there. It's there. We just gotta improve on it. We gotta really call on that fitness. Thank you. Hey, how's it going? Uh, good. How are you? Good. Um, so, my question I had, um, you know, there's some like these high school guys, and what kind of advice do you have for them? Like, what do you, what's the difference between where you're at now and where you were at that time? Because you've been around for. You know, I, I would say, uh, really, uh, you know, keep the desire. Keep that desire. You know, have big dreams. Have have goals, uh, and become a student of the sport. You know, anything you do, just uh, learn as much as you can. Uh, you know, you know to see what other people are doing. Uh, try it on yourself. I mean, obviously, with a coach's guidance as well. Make sure you have a coach there to, to kind of supervise or your parents. Uh, but, but definitely, just become a student of the sport. <laughs> All right, thanks. <laughs>